Hey guys, GMZ06 here again. Uh, I did a brief talk about with my car the last video, but I want to give you guys a quick little cold start up. Um, once again, this is an 86 Camaro IROC Z. Uh, I bought this from a dealership in Rhode Island. By the way, if you guys ever want to buy a used car, please, I highly recommend you guys go look at the car because my fucking dumbass, you know, when you buy things on an online auction, quote eBay, you don't have that option. So please, if you're going to buy a used car, go with somebody who knows about cars, look at the car thoroughly, okay? Make sure it's got a clear title. Luckily, this car didn't. Luckily, this car had a clear title. Um, I had to go through a long fucking process to get my fucking title here. But eventually, I got the goddamn thing. Um, anyway, uh, 86 IROC with uh, 108,000 miles on the car. This is not the original motor, I was told. This has a 350. Uh, I, I haven't verified that yet. I still have to check the uh, engine casting number and the engine uh, index code. Uh, index numbers on the front of the block. Um, but I want to give you guys a quick uh, cold start real quick. Uh, Let's go. By the way, Hawks Motorsports, if you're watching, thank you very much. I really appreciate you guys helping me out. I got my new hood struts. Same thing in the back. That really helps me out. Actually, when I put the new ones in the back now, uh, because my rear hatch motor is broken, which that's on the way from you guys. Thank you again. Uh, since I put the new hatch uh, struts in the back now, uh, now the thing doesn't want to go back down. Basically, so I had to actually bungee cord the rear hatch down. So anyway, uh, supposedly it's got a 305 in this. Uh, it's got a four barrel Holly. It's got a 4160 carb. Uh, I replaced the, all the headlights, uh, low beam and high beam. Uh, I'm still having an issue with the uh, driver's side high beam. It's probably a fuse. I'm not really sure yet. Um, I replaced the... Um, windshield washer fluid reservoir with a uh, a used one actually I did not want to get a reproduction um, you know you buy re reproduction parts you kind of lower the value of a car I know this car is old it's dirty but it'll, it'll look a lot nicer once I'm done um, I actually found a guy in Denver who was selling one and uh, this one works it's all good it does not leak so it actually works great um, this is a cold start. Uh, the battery has been disconnected for days. I haven't started this car up in probably, I don't know, over a week now. I'm hoping that it'll start. I'm going to disconnect the battery and uh, see what happens. Alright, hopefully so start let's see not sure well lights are on oh we know what help I had to put the key I'm just going to try to start it up. Nah, I think the battery's uh, not enough juice in the battery. It's gonna start today, guys. No, nope, not today. All right. Well, that was a total fail. It's not a really don't care. I really don't care. Anyway, let me. Go. 